my first general question is what kind of kid Mikita Valipo was when you were a child? In, uh, I, I think, think you grew uh, up in Minsk? Minsk? No, in Vitebsk. Vitebsk? Vitebsk. Huh. It's one of the coldest cities in, in Cold. my country, yes. Really? Oh. And uh, I started, not I started, uh, like uh, every kid in childhood, mm -hmm. I play in basketball, ping pong, football, uh, volleyball, uh, huh. doesn't matter what, just give me the ball and that's it. Okay. And uh, uh, I run a little bit in athletics, mm -hmm. uh, two, 100, 400, triple jump, uh, long jump. Mm -hmm. uh, I did, and after I stopped this small part of my career, mm -hmm. and after um, my friend uh, told me about the, uh, if you want, uh, you can come tomorrow to, to train a little bit in handball. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I didn't know nothing about the handball. I just uh, came uh, on the next day, and in front of me, like me, uh, this 60 or 70 kids, mm. it's age uh, like me. And after a couple of uh, days, uh, this part of kids uh, cut. And uh, after, I don't know, weeks or a couple of weeks, uh, I, stayed, I stay with the uh, 15 or 16 players, future players. Mm. And uh, I just enjoyed it this time and just play the football, some, you know, these small games and after the, the coach started to explain what, what about the handball, this ball, this different size of balls, uh, how we play, the, about the attack, different about the some fins, about the some uh, tricks, you know, and this uh, season number 17 huh? when I play in handball. And how was that to change your country? What is strange for you, for example, in Hungary? And uh, what is that you feel uncomfortable, for example, here in, in Hungary? So how was that? Uh, before I play, uh, play in, in Brest a couple of years, the last couple of years with the some Balkan players. And after I leave it, and I hear the also this 60 or 75 percent of Balkan, Balkan players who speak a lot of uh, Croatian, Serbian, uh, uh, language and for me, is, uh, I know this language and I speak a lot. I speak not fluently, but I understand a lot. And uh, for me, just uh, what for me is strange is uh, I cannot hear the, too much the Russian language. Mm -hmm. Just this and uh, second one, uh, this is uh, in the traffic. Uh, this some you know these blinkers yep. is. Uh, I think it's nobody use these blinkers. This is for me the strange. Yeah. Just uh, yeah. for me, I enjoy. I like. I like the. I love this food. This yeah. fat food. You know. This yeah. like goulash with the pista, a bomb. I like it. I like it too much. And uh, I like it. It's, I like this country. I like this. Almost the same the, about the weather. Uh, I don't feel the big difference. Mm -hmm. You know between the Brest and this uh, West Brom. You have been a uh, lot of uh, place in Hungary, as I can see on your, your social media. So you have been a lot in Budapest, see some museums, some squares and, and other some important points of, of Hungary. Uh, what is your, your feeling about it? To see, uh, for example, the, the bridge in, in Budapest and the squares and others. Uh, like uh, how I feel this big, big history, this long history in Hungary. Uh, when I, when I went uh, with uh, in this sparkling uh, thermal springs in, for yes. example, Rudos or uh, yeah. Arpat uh, or in Arpat, Arpat, yes. Yes, and yes. When I went uh, when I when I in, yeah. I saw this too much. You know this old old architecture. This yeah. I respect this. And uh, I love this uh, this part of the Hungary. This is architecture. This is oh, amazing. Okay, it's so great to hear. Thank you very much. Okay, so you are so active in, in social media. I can start with, uh, for example, your shooting challenge, what we can see on your Instagram or or, or TikTok, for example. Uh, is there a mission for you for for do these challenges? For example, the kids who are. Uh, <coughs> change their sport and start handball, for example? Or is just, uh, you are doing it for fun? Or, or 
when you sing us, what do you think about this? Uh, first of all, I try to, to be inspiration uh, for the kids mm -hmm. uh, who can speak with me. I can share with him, uh, with them, uh, with some rice bands, uh, shoes, socks, uh, doesn't matter what. Uh, they can speak with me, touch me. Uh, I'm not a superstar who, who live it. Uh, upstairs or in the sky and uh, nobody can uh, can see me on just on the pitch uh, when I play in the handball. No, I'm normal people like like everybody and uh, I try to be inspiration for the kids like I said before and for me these challenges uh, this maybe from my side this different view of handball. Uh, you can shoot alone you don't need to, to just train on the train two and a, or two or one and a half or two hours and that's it this handball is, is off yes. or out of uh, in your life you have to continue you have to to do something to try to to be inspiration like me yeah. to if for sure you need to find this some uh, some uh, some uh, guy or, or players who inspired you, yeah. and just continue, just watch w what he what he is doing, you know. And uh, for sure, when when I was the kid, and for, for me this uh, like legend, this Luca Balo, and uh, like I watched the too much the videos with with him, uh, how he move the play, the how he spin the shots doing this, yeah. and. He inspired me to do this, to, to do some some new direction, you know. Yeah. And I started to make the handball up for the kids. Mm -hmm. And uh, I don't know, uh, this deadline for me this in this summer or a little bit uh, later. And I will show you the, this app mm -hmm. uh, with the exercises on, on the pitch, with the sh okay. shooting exercise, with gym balance, yeah. some nutrition. You will see. Great, great. How do you relax in the, your free time, for example, when you are not traveling, uh, not in the gym, for example, or not playing handball? What what are you usually doing? Uh, to uh, to relax? I have different options. Uh, first of all, when I work, I relax. When I'm relaxed, I work. And the second, for sure, is painting or some create uh, some uh, new videos. Uh, in, in the handball on the field or the, uh, make some some sketches for uh, some brands uh, clo closest brands mm -hmm. uh, or I speak with my family I spend uh, too much time with my not too much I spend the time with my uh, wife mm -hmm. we just I, I don't know some barbecue or just walking uh, Next to the, my apartment, we have the, some zoo or forest. We just walk across uh, or through this forest and just enjoy the fresh air. And this, you know, this bird singing. Yeah, yeah. And that's it. It's great. It's a nice place, of course. Yes. Of course, next to the zoo, it's this uh, Guya Dom. We can mention it. It's, it's a really nice place. Okay, uh, after the, the Hungarian Cup, you know, in Dior, uh, you grab the, the Hungarian Cup trophy and uh, you have it for a day or, or for two days. And I, I think I saw some stories on your Instagram in, in Budapest, uh, for example. So my question is that, uh, uh, it, was it uh, worth for you a lot to win this uh, Hungarian Cup? It was your second cup because the first was the Seha Liga. Yes, but the, for me the Seha Liga is international uh, yeah, the cup, yeah, first yes. international cup. Yeah, and this but, was the first uh, domestic yes, trophy for you. But for me, for sure, it's important, like for everybody. Yeah, I try to uh, to share uh, my emotions with the fans, like after the game immediately with this, you know, this yeah, yeah. this gun. And, uh, uh, you know, for me, it's, for sure it's important, but for me, this is something special. Mm -hmm. Because I spoke a lot with the coach and stuff, and I explained what for me this. Yeah. For, for me, the handball is not just a job when I earn the money and after a couple of years, ciao, bacalao, see you. For me, this is life. I just breathe in. I, for me, this humble is breathing. You know, this breath, uh, fresh air, 
and I just enjoy the every day here. And it doesn't matter here or the next station or like before in Brest and Belarus. Mm -hmm. uh, I enjoy the every, every day and I just uh, try to share uh, what I have inside with the people who who support me and who wanted to see you on the first place always. Mm -hmm. Yes, I spent a couple of days in Budapest with the trophy. I, I slept with, with the, this trophy yeah, yeah. and uh, I have a couple of pictures with, with, with him. Yeah. And uh, I made a couple of video, videos with the trophy. Uh, you can see for sure yeah, on Instagram. I remember. You saw it. And for sure I enjoyed it. Yeah. He's my like like a child, you know, like a kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's, it's great to see that, that for you it's it's worth uh, a lot to reach this this step, you know, this uh, won this uh, Hungarian Cup trophy. It's nice nice to see. I just ask. <laughs> Pizza or hamburger? Pizza. Cinema or watching a movie at home? Uh, watching at home. Wellness or riding a bicycle? Uh, independent. Okay, wellness. Okay. Pool or sea? Oh, sea. Okay. Electronic music or hip hop? Electronic. Wine or beer? Uh, water. Pineapple on the pizza, yes or no? Yes. Action movie or comedy? Oh, action. Okay, thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay. Okay. Gyerekek, gyerekek, szeretek a percek, sósat, sósat, jóra pagósat. Aki vesz, ennek lesz. Aki nem lesz, ehis lesz. Bomba! Yeah,